let me draw a background first so by using this rectangular tool draw a rectangle here and send this one to the back and now let me lock it now take this text tool and change the color of the text from here let's choose this white color and write the text 3 so color is not changed let me change it again and duplicate this one by pressing alt key and drag it and edit this write D and now drag it and make the size little bit bigger now select both go to object expand ok now select this go to effect 3d and click here and you can preview it and from here you can increase the prospective size and from here increase the depth so when you increase the depth this one will be extended so we are giving 71 and click OK. Now select this one, go to Effect 3D and apply the same. So here last time we have given 71, give 71 this time. And here also you can manipulate it and click OK. Now select this one, go to object and here do expand appearance and now ungroup it. Now again ungroup it. Now select those by pressing shift key, unselect this, this and now unite it now select up to here unselect this one and unite it and here also do the same unselect this and unite it now you can apply color to this Select this one and apply color. Apply this color. Now from here group it and place it here. Now select it and from here click on reflect tool and drag this one by pressing alt key and take it here. And choose horizontal axis copy. And from here take this rectangular tool and draw a rectangle from here to here and this one and take this one and fix this color angle And here select this one
now select this one and this one by pressing shift key and from here go to transparency and from this option you'll find this make capacity mask click here now take rectangular tool and from here draw a rectangle and choose gradient color fix the gradient angle and here reduce the opacity now select it and reduce total opacity from here hope you like this tutorial